Hey everybody, it's Eileen from Basic Blog Tips. I know a few of you are concerned about social media and the amount of time that you spend on it and whether or not it's worth your while. So here's a couple of tips I have for you to take a look at where you stand with social media and in particular Twitter and Facebook and uh, what you can possibly do about it. So first I'd like to introduce you to a tool that's called Clout. And Clout attempts to measure your social media presence. And you can log into Clout and your URL for Clout is going to be the same as your URL for Twitter, only replace the word Twitter with Clout. That's Clout with a K. And you can connect your Twitter account, Facebook, and LinkedIn. And just to give you a quick overview of what the Clout dashboard looks like, or your profile on Clout, you'll see the people that you are influencing because they're retweeting you quite often. But here's something else. You've got your score analysis, and I want to draw your attention to your topics. And the reason I'm going to skip over some of the other things and go right to topics is because I think this is really important. This is where you find out if you're really tweeting about the things that are relevant to you. For me, it's blogging, writing, social media, WordPress, of course, the social web, Firefox, entrepreneurship and technology, Facebook and PageRank. Now these are the things that Clout has picked up on its own just by analyzing my activities over the social web. If I thought that any of these categories did not apply to me, I could easily go in here and just get rid of them. Another neat thing that you can do, and we can all do for each other, is give each other some clout. So now, what does it mean to give someone some clout? Once you log into clout, let's just take, for example, my friend, Francisco. He goes by the Twitter name of Detesco. I can go in here and see here's some of his topics listed here. I can either click on see all or I can click on topics over here. Let's do it this way. And all I'd have to do is go in here and say, okay, what do I think that the Tesco is influential about? And I'm going to say blogging. I love his blog and he has a wonderful one. So I'll give him a plus K. Now, I just gave that to him. You get five per day, which is good. I think five is a great number because that way no one can really gain the system. Now, if I wanted to share that on Facebook or tweet about it, I could do either one. I'll tweet about it. And because I'm logged in, I'm already connected with Twitter, so it goes right to my Twitter account. Something else I'd like to show you, especially the uh, Google Chrome users. You can get an extension for Cloud, and the one that I like is from a place called Connects. And when you go into Connects for Chrome, I have it installed, installed already. You're going to get an abundance of tools. And here's all the tools that you can get. And right here, you're going to see Cloud. So go ahead and install that. By the way, I think you should also install Hover Me. I've talked about it before, but this time I'm going to show it to you in action. I have these installed already, but go ahead and download them and install them. And now coming back over to Twitter and these extensions work with new Twitter only. And I suggest that everyone update to new Twitter. 
and you'll see that my cloud score is right next to my image, my avatar. But if you hover over that avatar, and this is where Hover Me comes in, you'll see all of my profiles across the social web. Hey, so sign up for Clout. Make sure you have your Twitter and your Facebook and LinkedIn accounts connected. Make sure your topics are in line with what's relevant to you. I think you can reinforce those topics by using hashtags when you tweet and increase your engagement by showing some plus K love. Well, thanks so much for joining me. Stay tuned for more about clout, social media, blogging, and WordPress. Once again, it's Eileen from Basic Blog Tips. Have a great day.